Dryer vent hoods for roofs come in multiple styles. The objective of a vent hood for the dryer is basically twofold. Prevent backdrafts and prevent bird and rodent entry as well as nest building. A vent hood or fitting that creates excessive back pressure not only lengthens the drying cycle but accelerates dangerous lint buildup. Up until now no one has assessed the static pressure levels that these roof vents provide. This video will demonstrate the actual difference or delta of air pressure measured with a magnahelic gauge before and after a few different vent hoods were attached. We call this differential pressure. The higher the differential pressure, the less efficient the vent hood is. This gauge will provide some idea of an efficient vent and a very poor vent. In selecting your next roof vent, pick one that not only prevents backdrafts and bird nesting, but that also produces the least amount of differential pressure. Okay, this is the back of a real dryer running right now. We're using it to test. Over here we've tapped into it, into the duct line. And with this tubing it goes up and hooks into the magnahelic side, the magnahelic gauge. We're going to show you just a quick test here. Right now you can see it was running at 0.45, that's how much water colorimetric pressure exists. If I add this typical wall outlet, popular wall outlet to it, we'll watch the pressure increase and it'll give us some idea how much resistance this particular termination is going to provide. So it went from 0.45 all the way up to a solid one inch of water column, actually 1.04, 1.05. Point Big roof jack, so we start out at point three again. 